MLB prize picks for Thursday, April 6th. I'm Sniper Ford, DFS Army. Let's go find some winners. We'll start with a recap of yesterday, continuing kind of our 67% hit rate, 12 and 6 on the season, 2 and 1 yesterday. The hitters get their uh, Cassis and Langoliers. And uh, Otani, I believe, gave up a first inning run. It was a flex. I don't know. Somebody gave up a first inning run uh, in that game. So we'll go 2 or 3 on these picks. This three pick was a fail, but I mentioned yesterday I saved these throughout the day, Used made a bunch of pairs. Still a decent day overall uh, and a really good day for the DFS Army uh, members, especially uh, basketball, tons of hits. I mention it all the time. I'm giving you a peek right now inside of our Discord just from last night. You know, member popping off for a six for six. Plenty of screenshots as I scroll through posting guys who just went off yesterday. Uh, Coach Mutt swept us with that. The image was so we had a lot of guys going off yesterday. So if you're not a DFS Army member, you should strongly consider checking that out. I guess to give you all, all your codes up front, if you need to get on prize picks, use the code Sniper $100 deposit match and two free months of DFS Army prop subscription. We get you access to the Discord you just saw and picks and plays and access to uh, the Discord. We got PGA, NBA, MLB, soccer, tennis, MMA. All the good stuff in there. Make sure you check that out to join straight up. That link is in the description. Code Sniper20 gets you 20% off. It's under 20 bucks a month. Um, I highly recommend you guys give that a look. Before we get into the picks for today, I got three more for you. If you do me a favor, hit that like button. Hit the subscribe button so you get these people. Um, were telling me yesterday that, that Cass has got pulled off the board. I posted that play in chat. In Discord before I post the video, members get it first, and it got pulled off pretty quick by the time the video went live. So I would recommend um, hitting subscribe and getting in the Discord. All right, let's go ahead and look at the plays for today. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go over and show you also with access to DFS Army, you get uh, or a sub to DFS Army, you get access to the tool. Tools allow you to compare price pick lines to DraftKings odds to some of our projections, and that's where I'm going to pull our first play from. Uh, Jake Berger, uh, hit line, total base is 0.5, which is basically getting any hit, minus 140. It's a really solid number in terms of what your implied odds are here on prize picks. Jake Berger, more than 0.5 total bases. Uh, this one, I'm starting with this one. This one has the potential to do not play. We're expecting Berger to DH. He is got, got called up yesterday. Uh, Aloy Jimenez for the White Sox got put on the 10-day DL, uh, so he will not be playing. And now you got Jake Berger, and there Berger takes on Alex Wood, who I know it's a good name, but Alex Wood to me is a regressing veteran. Uh, we got the, the favorable lefty-righty matchup here. Wood last year, eight for tw eight and twelve record, 5.10 ERA. I think he can be got at. Uh, I, I think Berger will be in the lineup. We're not 100% sure on that. So make sure you have some other plays in your pocket um, with some of the for some of the other things, the two other plays I'm going to put out there. Don't pair Berger with everything because he very well could do not play. Um, so just you know be prepared. We have plenty of picks for you in the DFS Army Discord. Jake Berger that minus 140 line will be the first play of today's video. We're also going to go to play number two, one who. Should play, and a play I really like is Lane Thomas. We're going to go with this run line, 0. 0.5. We're going to go more than 0. 0.5 run for Lane Thomas. This is also minus 140 at the Sportsbook. He is shown that he's going to lead off against uh, left-handed pitching, which he faces today. This line is, it's, I believe it's like up to minus 165 on FanDuel right now. This is the first Coors game of the year. And the total is at 11 runs, and it's leading off for the visitors. I like the run line for that reason. Just it, it's a really it, – it's a positive start. He's off to a good start this season in terms of hitting. He's 8 for 24. I think it's all singles, but I don't care how he gets, how he gets on base uh, at course. Get on base at course. You've got a good chance to come around starting off the season uh, 333. So we'll go Lane Thomas more then 0.5 runs for play number two. Before we give it the last play one more time, guys, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. The likes really do help. You would be surprised. Appreciate you guys who do come back every day. We'll find play number three for this morning. And remember, value more value pops in throughout the day. Uh, these aren't the only plays we put out there. Obviously, 
Discord is jamming all the time. Um, not sure if I'm going to get to an NBA video today just because NBA is so volatile this week of the season. Um, by the time lock comes around, the game's about to start. We have a pretty good idea what the news is going to be, who's going to do what, and we'll more plays in Discord then. Uh, we'll kind of see how the line shake out. Maybe we'll do an NBA video today on this channel. So hit that subscribe button in case that comes up. Play number three. As you can see, we're going to go Brandon Belt. We're going to go more than 0.5 at total bases here as well. It's minus 135 on DraftKings, minus 140 at the Pinnacle Sportsbook. Uh, Pinnacle. Um, let's take it on uh, Jordan Lyles in this one. He is, he's got good DVP against Lyles. Uh, six for 18, 333 average. Off to a slow start this year. I'm a little bit concerned here, but I like. I mean, it's hard not to not like the line, just the Im implied value, and a good hitter like Belt. He's off to a one for 15 start. So if you're really into form, you don't have to play Brandon Belt. Quite honestly, um, just kind of giving you. I, I'm more leaning into the line and the BVP here that pushes it just over the top for me. So Brandon Belt, uh, pretty good total baseline. We'll go more than. 0.5. So in terms of ranking the plays, I really like the Lane Thomas line quite a bit at 0.5 runs. It's play number, you know, my top play of the day. Then you got Jake Berger. This oh, more than 0.5 total bases would be my second favorite play. The issue is here. He may, he may not play. We're kind of assuming. I think he will. Brandon Belt, 0.5 total bases more. That'll be the third play of the video. I kind of decide how I want to play it. We'll go ahead and I'll do a small play on just the three pack, and I'll play my favorite two. I'll take I'll take belt out, and if I get the good old the good news here, I'm gonna make my, my two pack play of Burger and Thomas. The good news is that Burger this lineup Boy Sox lineup should out before. It's a 2:10 Eastern time game. I'll know I can cancel the injury and I can pair Lane Thomas with something else. Hopefully, it's still still on the board. That is a risk I'm taking, but it's why I have the Thomas and Belt play already locked in just in case. That's what I got for you guys for the three plays for today. Hope to see you in the DFS Army Discord where you give out more plays all day long, all sports, making money for our members for under 20 bucks a month. That link is in the description. Make sure you go and click on it. And either way, it's your daily reminder that whether or not you are a DFS Army member, Good luck in those contests, and I'll see you next time here on YouTube.